Now we need to equate h to square root of 17. That means square root of 34 sine theta plus 59.036 degrees. This is going to be square root of 17. So sine theta plus 59.036 degrees is going to be square root of 17 divided by square root of 34, which is square root of 17 over 34, which is square root of 1 over 2, which is 1 over square root of 2. And I'm going to find first the basic angle. The basic angle is going to be sine inverse of 1 over square root of 2, and this is a special angle, it is 45 degrees which means that theta plus 59.036 degrees is going to be equal to, since sine is a positive value, this angle here is going to be either in the first quadrant or the second quadrant. If it were to be in the first quadrant, it is 45 degrees. If it were to be in the second quadrant, it will be 180 degrees minus 45 degrees, which means that theta is going to be either, either this, if I were to bring it across, it is minus 14.036 degrees and this is not applicable because from the diagram that we have here, theta must be an acute angle. So the other possibility is if I were to shift 59.036 over for and when I work out the value for this, theta is going to be equal to 76.0 degrees and this is the value of theta that I want.